So I am uncomfortable with this concept of work-life balance um, because balance is achieved with two opposing forces. And why should work and life be in opposition, right? And uh, I, I don't think there's, if you don't have work-life balance, if you're struggling to find work-life balance, no amount of yoga will fix that, right? Um, taking off an extra week of vacation, and by the way, vacation means you're not working on the beach. That's just telecommuting from a beach. Um, um, but I believe in, in uh, that, the, that you're able to build a life where work and personal life become, uh, not only you say interchangeable, but smooth. And what I mean by that is they're not necessarily confined by hours in a day, but rather where I choose to give effort. So for example, if it's four o'clock in the afternoon, technically part of the work day, and you're hankering for a run because it's a day like this, you can go for a run. Like, that's, you know, and one of the, th one of the mistakes that I've made was treating things that are important to my mind, my body, my spirit, as stump something that I'm suppo only supposed to do off hours or on weekends. Sure. But just like I can't decide when I have an idea, sometimes it's on Saturday and sometimes it's in the evening, mm -hmm. I also can't decide when I need a break. Sometimes it's something I feel, not something I plan for. And so we've gotten really good. It's imperfect. You know, sometimes responsibility takes precedence, but we've gotten really good in our little company that if somebody wants to take an afternoon to be with their kids, they put in their calendar with my kids. Mm -hmm. I, a long time ago, I used to have, when I, when I had um, a different form of a business before all of this stuff, we used to have things called duvet days, which I, I, get, I can't remember, we had like five duvet days a year or something. And a duvet day was, you wake up in the morning, you just don't want to come to work. You're totally healthy. Or it's a beautiful day and I just would rather go to the beach. So you'd call up and leave a message at 8 o'clock in the morning or 7 o'clock in the morning and be like, hey, I'm taking a duvet day, I'll see you tomorrow. And no one would bother you, right? And people are like, that's amazing that you do that, Simon. I'm like, people are doing that anyway. It's called, <coughs> hey, I think I have a 24-hour bug. I'm not going to be at work today. And they go to the beach. So just call it out. Um, you know, schedule. Time at the gym in the middle of the day, if that's when you like working out. And I just found the, the more seamless that we can make work and life, um, the more we start to enjoy both more. Because they're not, they're not opposing. <laughs> <laughs>